Hey, everybody. Welcome to NFT Art Galaxy. Oh, man. I am always really excited, but I am really, really excited today. <laughs> and uh, no, we are not in a render in the blender with D4. He is actually here on the show. In Amen. The flesh. We go we go way back to uh, met you at my first spaces, Mr. Pimp Space. And that's that's kind yes. of when I, when I fell in love with this guy and his uh, his, his art. So um, he is creator of Delta Crew. He is also behind the old Vlad Algomancer feud that uh, everybody seems <laughs> to love. The good back and forth uh, banter. Uh, we'll see who who rises to the top there. And Delta recently, Crew uh, sure. alien tourism as well. Yes, and a bunch yes. of other stuff that we're not going to get into, like Neon Miami and all this other stuff that <laughs> might be pipe dreams. But Mister <laughs> D4, ladies and gentlemen. It is an honor to be here, Rich. Finally, I was starting to wonder if you'd ever bring me onto your podcast. I was like, do, do I need more followers? Do I need better art? And I'm, like, I'm so hyped to be here. I'm, it's nice, awesome. man. Well, we are glad to glad to have you and kind of get a little background of, of kind of where, where you came from, where you're at right now, and, and maybe a little bit of where, you know, the projects and stuff are going. And Looking at the Delta crew right here, I mean, pretty impressive. Um, 86.5 thousand algo volume, or is that not? They have dollar volume now. 55. Oh, wow. I didn't, it's a new and improvement, right? Right here. Yeah, we just broke it here first. Thank you. Yeah, just, just noticed that. I'm like, wow, that's <laughs> awesome. <laughs> I guess that goes up and down as, as algo goes up and down. Yeah, um, it's, uh, I'm going to take a screenshot of that because, yeah, that's a nice number. That's good. So it no, it's awesome to be here, man. It's I'm excited to, yeah, show off some of my art and yeah, especially with alien tourism and a few new things we've got planned for that. So that's going to be awesome. Dropped a new um, animation today with their toilet flushing. So yeah, that's a really good one. Oh yeah, I did see that. I could bring that up right here. I that's. I was like, yeah. I, I need to uh, go to the bathroom. <laughs> yeah, use some nice fluid sims on that toilet. It, it turned out well. And that final splash on the wall there, it's, it's that's one of those too. happy mistakes that yeah, we're definitely going to leave in there. That's <laughs> oh, no, awesome. good, man. Super excited to work on this project. I think it's, yeah. Yeah, we're man. Be bringing a high quality art to it. And yeah, with all the traits and everything we've got planned in the future, it's it's going to be a cool series. I can't wait for you to you know, see what we have planned when it finally comes yeah, into play. Well, I'm going to send my aliens in. I just did that today. I have all my yeah, de definitely do that, man. DMs. Yeah. I didn't know anything anything about it, but um, yeah, it's right here. You have until February 28th to send back your board aliens. I'm not sure yes. what happens. Maybe you could tell us. But we send the aliens in. We get on a, a whitelist or something like that. Yeah, I'm not sure if I can say much, but yeah, it's definitely you want to send your aliens, you want to get, <coughs> excuse me, on the Discord and yeah, get all that set up because yeah, there's going to be some good things coming to any um, water alien yes. holders, which so is good pretty... since it's, it's yeah, since it was a pretty bad like what happened with it. So yeah, just yeah. giving back to the community, you saying this isn't <laughs> this is an alien project you can trust. Like we're not a rug pull. We haven't copied anyone in any way. Like yeah. I'm the artist. I, I can give you a hundred percent guarantee. I haven't copied anyone. So it's yeah. All original art here. No, no probes though. <laughs> yeah. So I mean, oh, look, I can't guarantee there won't be any probes, but yeah. But you got a, got a pretty, pretty solid team. So it's you, uh, Jared Blitz and I believe Keeks. Is there, is there anybody yeah, else so, involved in this? Um, yeah. Allego on a hike, Jared and yeah keegs and okay. yeah me so they're taking call uh care of all the social media and marketing side of it and i'm just doing all the art so i get nice. the easy bit which is good well that's i mean yeah i can't even chew gum and talk at the same time or walk and, and you're <laughs> rendering in the blender i mean that's I, yeah. love, I love when you do those but yeah, uh, i love it it's it's so much fun and yeah especially this series of the the awesome Vlad, like in this back and forth. What's happening here? What's reading... this? <laughs> Excuse me. An award for the weakest species. Yeah, that, that's a real nice one, Vlad. Thanks for that. Yeah. It's on now. This was a good one. This I I would like yeah, to have he's... this one on my wall. 
yeah, he's always talking up his T-Rex. And I'm like, yeah, you know what? I've got something better than a T-Rex, a Megalodon. Yeah. So, yeah, I've, I've got another one planned for him. Probably be out either tomorrow or the next day. So Okay. Yeah. Yeah, we got this one for all I've you got to poker top that players award out one, there. Because that was pretty good, that award one. Yeah, but you got, you got, you got to think of something. Oh, I've got thousands of ideas. There's no... It's... Yeah, it's and trying it's, to dial back the crazy in it so it can't be too bad. Nice. Yeah, I like what you did here for... Uh, yeah, that Hogan Hogan Meister billion dollar Sherry, Billion dollar heist. I love it. He was doing a billion dollar... Uh, drive there charity drive that's pretty cool yeah it's good like yeah i was more than happy to support that so i just thought it's fitting to um yeah have the crew stealing a billion dollars and that's part six of the delta crew story so i'll be um getting hamburger print to write the story for that so that'll be out probably next friday part six seven and eight should be out so looking forward oh, to that wow. It's slowly telling the story that's going to tie into the short movie and then to season one of the community driven story. Oh, I can't wait. Yeah, so it should be fun getting those out there and it's just tying in that story that's, yeah, it's going to be this coherent thing from point A to point B. So it's not just like my random adventures. How they tell a slight story, but not to the point as the actual Delta Cruise story is. And then yeah. I've also got the Delta Crew Fallen series, where it's just pictures of how specific crew members have died in the past. So that should be out. Oh, that's coming out. Oh, all right. I like yeah. it. I like it. That's a cool series. Had a few of them on Instagram and they've been doing really well. So I thought, oh, I might as well continue this because I can put a story to this and it's, yeah, it's going to tie into everything else. Yeah, you're a big star on Instagram. Look at this. 9,995 followers. Ooh. Refresh, see if we finally hit 10,000. I, did, I didn't know you had that many siblings. <laughs> yeah, I guess those that are the, many those, accounts. Those oh, are the, so those close. Are the, those are the inmates. So on, close. Uh, oh, man. <laughs> I, you know what? I actually we'll, have We'll a check back accounts. later. I'm going to see 10,000 on this stream. I think I liked you here. Maybe I should unlike you. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> That's cold, man. Come on. No, this yeah, these... Great... um. These two here are oh, going to be 8, part 000. of the Fallen series. So, yeah, this is, yeah, one of the Fallen series. And then, yeah, the ones with all the spears in them, that's part of the Fallen series. So, it's awesome little picture. The theme of these are the butterflies, kind of like, yeah, symbolizing, you know. And where's where's the egg in this one? <laughs> it's right. Oh, it's is just, right? yeah, okay. it's in that part there I'm pointing at. Yeah, it's just I, I, will, there. I will find out where, where the <laughs> egg is before before I die, I hope. Look, I hope. yeah, th there's an egg in there. It's this one. That one's hard to see. This one's a little bit easier. Which one? This one? Uh, the one above that, where they've got the spears from. So if people don't know what D4 is talking about, he he has a, a hidden object in his his work. And if you find it, I don't know what, you get like a new car or what, what, hap what happens? <laughs> yeah. Well, could be. It's, it, yeah. As I've said in the past on my streams, it's in every ran every Delta Crew render, except for the Crew series. They're in Snapshot, but yeah, not the Crew because it's a bit hard to hide it in a PFP series. It just would have stuck out. I, I can't find it. <laughs> Look, it, it's I haven't made it easy. Like this one would be near impossible to find, but it's there. Yeah. I know it's there. Well, this one you made for uh, Angel of Errors, I believe. For, yeah, for their, it was uh, awesome. I was super um, surprised myself with the lighting effects that I use and the nice fog and then the kind of like, yeah, blue haze coming down from the angel. I think, yeah, it's one of those amazing. weird moments where I surprise even myself with what I do and then I can't remember how I did it. Yeah, I think if, if everybody hasn't seen D4 in action uh, with the, the render in the blender, uh, when he does them, I think you should definitely, definitely join he makes these pieces right, right in front of your eyes. Yeah, I love that piece. So That's much fun! Cool. So much fun on these AXD series. Is the uh, coffee bean one in here somewhere? The one that we did, or no? The, the oh, coffee, 
coffee bean dance. It wasn't really for the coffee bean dow. It was uh, one of the render in the blenders that we did with the pool and the. Oh, the. Um, tiki oh, there one. it is. It's right here. Yeah, there it is. Yeah, it's in here. Yeah, yeah I this... have that in there. So. Well, how how long <laughs> were we on there? Six oh, hours? Eight hours? That felt like a while. I think it was like, yeah, close to six, like seven hours. Yeah. But it was just so much fun that whole time. Like it was. We're too busy laughing then. Yeah, actually, you're doing this render and yeah, having natives suggest all this crazy stuff. And then yeah, having the coffee beans, the flamingos, the poor Astro on fire, the strippers, and then the scorecards. It was we got my, my hamburgers, time. don't forget. Yes, your hamburger there, like two Ball player. Big hamburgers. And I think it all it them. all started with the asteroid, I think. I think that's yeah, yeah. I can't remember who suggested, but yeah, asteroid riding and that. Uh, an asteroid yeah and then the pool happened and then yeah i think the jet ski in the pool and then yeah the drunk astronaut <laughs> and then the base diver and then yeah all the other craziness all right there's just tons oh. of stuff in there the pool yeah. the pool is drained that's when uh when we <laughs> yeah. got rugged with the tiny man <laughs> yeah that's it the liquidity pools down yeah uh, it's good it's taxing like by the end of it i'm completely exhausted just from concentration okay, and laughing and then yeah try, just trying to make sense of the suggestions but yeah i love it it's good fun so i really haven't been, been, been doing while. this a very long time how did <laughs> yeah. how did you get started i mean how did you get into rendering in in the blender and learning that and kind of what what set you off well, on this path or from cutting this finger off so it got reattached so pretty much all from there down just got yeah severed so yeah having that time off when it got repaired and put back on and then yeah just by chance to like i was at my brother's house and he suggested um blender we were watching an actual tutorial so i'm like yeah i'll, I'll give it a go i've got the time like i'm not working so yeah started playing around with it did the donut then jumped on a heap of other tutorials and just started to get a real feel a real passion for it and it's just it's one of those things that just spoke to me. It wasn't like a struggle to learn anything. It was more just yeah, that excitement of learning a new skill, like learning a new way from fluid simulations to smoke to fire. And then, yeah, to like basic geometry nodes, like yeah, all the crazy stuff. And then, yeah, just creating a series out of it. And yeah, it was great. Like ever since wow. then, I always push myself to learn something new from yeah new a new tutorial that pops up or a new update on blender 3 i know there's thousands of new things on there so you know, just learning all the functionality of that so it's just progressed from there never in my life would i think oh i'm going to be doing this full time as yeah a job and then yeah creating art and then people throughout the world buying it it's just yes yeah, it's, it's one amazing of those, yeah dream dream come a dream you never knew you wanted but it came true and yeah i thank my collectors my supporters every day that i can keep bringing this and then always make sure that i'm bringing better quality than the last picture because yeah i don't want to let them down in any way and then bringing that to alien tourism and then yeah the axd series so yeah it's awesome fun i can't wait to see where it goes and then yeah planning the short movie that's going to be insane i can't wait for that yeah, that's what um, Rivals was about. Just a little test of like, yeah, getting the feel for animations and yeah, could I do a fight scene? So it was really good. Yeah, I got a couple of them on here I saw. I didn't play any. Yeah, I think, yeah, there's Rivals and then... That was a good yeah. one, that one. That was fun making that, especially the sound design. That's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah. Especially yeah. making all those sounds was the fun bit. My poor neighbors, I was just yeah, doing all these screams and hits and <laughs> that's cool, like like Mortal Kombat kind of. Yeah, I got the idea. Oh yeah, I was playing a fighting game. Like this would be cool with astronauts. Like this real, yeah, kind of yeah, weird fight scene where they no no reason why they're fighting it's just that whole like orange versus blue all right well that's the that's the delta crew right <laughs> yeah that's it it's 
it's just madness and i think it'd be good to tie off um the axd series with like an animation fight like that that yeah, would be pretty cool one. pretty epic yeah this took so long to render i think it was 1.6 million individual hairs and yeah she's dancing and then oh wow yeah the materials wrapping around us so it's yeah animating that at the same time and yeah, my computer did not like me for that and it's a perfect loop too so that'll just keep going around and around it all lines up that's wild so so um so the delta crew story or is that is that kind of going to be like the um the movie where the holders of your pieces get to kind of vote on what happens to them is that yeah part of yeah so after the 10 piece series and then that's going to tie into the short movie and then beyond the short movie that's when the um choose your own adventure style of it starts where every week there's going to be yet yeah, two sessions of voting from they might be going to this specific planet or they might run into this certain trouble like on the way to the planet and everyone can vote what they're going to do and then yeah i'll do a small render for that and then there'll be another one at the end of the week that will tie into like all right yeah so they won the fight they yeah looted all the um enemies and you can pick these objects like who's gonna get them or you're just gonna yeah chuck them out the airlock and then there might be other situations where they can try and talk their way out of a situation or just shoot their way out and <laughs> anything like that's going to have consequences like down the road or one of the crew members might die and there's only a specific amount of crew members so if they all die the mission's over like that season's done but if that season lasts the time that i want it to it's tied up on another short movie and then season two starts and so on so it gives everyone a chance to go oh we can't really continue this story forever so tie it up and then yeah it gives me time right gives me and hamburger pimp time to yeah come up with some new stuff and then yeah progress through that so we are definitely definitely looking forward to that yes and the crew members are super upgraded for that um choose your own adventure side of it so yeah, they're get completely different look but yeah they're gonna look badass okay they, it's gonna kind of be um yeah unveiled in the short movie like the last few scenes like yeah the 2.0 delta crew is going to walk in and yeah it's going to be good i can't i can't wait man there's nothing there's nothing out there like this for sure i mean the creativity always my favorite that and number one this one this this has always been my favorite uh, i've always loved that i i don't know what about it i think yeah it's just the velociraptor punching out of a yeah, astronaut helmet so That's it's awesome. gonna be interesting to render that in the metaverse and <laughs> see this weird astronaut with a velociraptor hanging out of its head but yeah, it should be good well if anybody could do it man it's you d4 absolutely <laughs> yeah. i love a challenge so that's exciting. So, I mean, it's a, I mean, it's amazing. How many, it's how, how many months has it been? So you started what back in October? Jeez. I think it was August. I'm trying okay, to well, remember. Yeah. You, well, that's 2000. Well, you've been on Twitter before. Yeah. Most, most people's Twitter, you see that they joined like the month they joined. Yeah, is... just... No, I had this Twitter and yeah, it just sat, I had like three followers until, <laughs> yeah, I started yeah with the delta crew and yeah sell um selling on ethereum and then yeah it's just gone yeah upwards from there because yeah it was i, I forgot i had this account and then i'm like i might as well use it like everyone's saying twitter's a good platform to yeah get your art out there and yeah it's just grown ever since the same with instagram like i started that the same day as i started this with yeah that that started with zero followers and just every, every day for the last 230 something days i've always put a new piece of art in there getting there on, there it is there yes! it is <laughs> yes i wish Finally i had some, 10, some balloons and confetti for you <laughs> yes i mean that's i awesome. don't know if it means anything but I'd, i've got ten thousand. that's good enough for me all right should i screenshot i can screen grab this send it to you yeah you can screen grab that right here bam you gotta send, send that out 
cool. It's been good. Like it's the progression on um Instagram has been great. Besides the fact that every every second comment saying, "Oh, this is Among Us," that um video game with the astronauts, I'm like, it's got nothing to do with that game. Yeah, it's using astronauts, but yeah, it's nothing like that. Right. So, yeah. yeah this is this has a life of its own absolutely yeah oh, it is that with any project like it it starts off like in a way innocent and then it just grows into this you know, crazy entity of itself it's always love seeing with new projects that come along and just that expansion of what they're doing that just blows up overnight it's good so if you have do you have any advice for for new new projects that are coming out things they should I, I do, think, things they should not do. The biggest thing I think any of us learn and have to learn is patience. Like, yeah, we always see that overnight success of like someone dropping and then it sells out instantly. And yeah, they've made a ton of money. It's yeah, it's possible, but not for all of us. Like it's, it's, it, it could be luck or you might just know the right person, but just patience, like just, and concentrate on your art. Don't, don't worry about, yes, the selling side is the best, but concentrate, like keep that quality. Don't, don't ever like let that quality go and just be present in all the communities, like in Twitter spaces, on discord channels, and just in the comments and just, yeah, just, just show appreciation and support to other artists. And yeah, you're going to get noticed quick if you're doing right. stuff like that. And it's, and it's just, yeah, just, just be a part of everything. And just yeah, bring a great attitude and yeah, just be excited, be passionate. And yeah, it's it's gonna shine through not only in your work, but yeah, in the demeanor that you have on social media. So yeah, I mean the the one other thing that I see that's apparent from all of your work is that like you you are a one man show where you can do everything on your own. You you pretty much mm -hmm. could. I mean, you got you have the art. Um and you obviously have the promotional skills and and, and, and such, but you work with other people to to help you with your ideas and expand upon them and now you know you're having this back and forth series with vlad ellie and tori so you you're you're making you know friends and partnerships with with different artists out here that also have different skills and such you know and do different types of art right some of the they're, they're photographers and what so i mean it's just you know you, you expanding yourself i guess is i mean i, I think yeah. you're so personable and, and kind of approachable and, and it's just you, you know i guess you're 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 kind of like a magnet right <laughs> yeah it's, it's just having that that attitude of like always be open to new things and new challenges it's not be stagnant not be locked into like it has to do this it's like yeah yeah you can run along like that but also plan for the unknown plan for that one conversation where someone like I look at with Hamburger Pim, he just hit me up one day in the comments. Oh, is it cool if I um, do a description for a piece of your art? I'm like, yeah, man, absolutely. Go ahead. And that's how we met. So wow. he sent me this awesome description. I'm like, man, do, do you want to what? Do you want to write the rest of mine for that? Especially like for the story. And yeah, ever since then, you know, we, we're chatting like every week on Discord. And yeah, you were playing Neon Miami one day <laughs> and yeah it's it's just being open to those small little suggestions of say someone saying oh could i help you out here and it's like it, it's yes it's good to do stuff by yourself but i'm man enough to say yes i need i need a hand every now and then like you can do it by yourself but you're gonna you're gonna burn out eventually right so having that time to and just having that just yeah just to be willing to say you know what if you want to help me, help me. Like, do a couple of test pieces, and if you can, yeah, jump on board. We'll see what you can do. It's yeah, and yeah, I think yeah, we all have to do that occasionally because when it gets to a certain point, it gets to a certain size, you're like, well, it, I need to sleep sometime, so I, I do need a hand to do all this. <laughs> and, and it's apparent that now with yeah, with Delta Crew, and then yeah, Alien Tourism. Like, yeah, I'm super busy, but. Lucky I don't sleep much, so yeah, that's one yeah good side of it. <laughs> well, I'm sure you're having fun, or you wouldn't wouldn't be doing it. No, oh, that's it. If the passion wasn't you know? there, I'd be like, well, what what's the point? It's just it's going to start showing in your work if there's no passion. You're just going to be 
slapping stuff together going that's all good and you know, yeah like, i mean used i used to do that to collectors new and old so well i think you're going to be blowing the collectors minds for 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 a pretty pretty long time so yeah Re- really excited I, I think once the short movie's out everyone's going to see yeah what i have planned so it's yeah it's been held up like waiting for the motion capture suit but it's been good because of it's given me the time to jump onto alien tourism so i'll get a, a bulk of that done and then once the suit comes it's like yeah delta crew and then alien tourism so it'll always between those two projects so it's gonna be good i can't wait well so excited man thank you thank you so much for coming on and, and sharing all this with the community i love it i'm gonna link all of uh your well if you, you already hit 10,000, but you can yes. still put it down there for you to you to get some more followers there. I'll put all your links if you want to contact D4 and uh, check out his work. That's but awesome, I appreciate Thank you very much for having me too. Um, yeah. Definitely we'll have you back on. So you're, you're awesome, harmless. Man. So yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no. Well, thanks, Eats, man. It's been great. So everybody like the video, love the video, share it, comment below. Again, all the information will be there. Thank you guys. And until next time, take care. Thank you. Love you all. Algo fam.